Hey man, say man, look, we about to keep going on with these man. Hold on, bro. Y'all go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like the video, man. Comment down below what y'all think, man. Let's get it, man. Let's go. Oh, hold on, bro. I'm trying to get to this, bro. Hold on, dog. I'm trying to get to this, man. Let's All right, it. Sergeant, can you swear in, Mr. Williams? Jeffrey Williams, J E F F E R Y W I L L I A M S. He he tall as hell. Damn. Good afternoon, Mr. Williams. Good afternoon. Are you the same Jeffrey Williams indicted in case number? Your Honor. Yes, ma'am. Actually, have we all signed the indictment, or are we going to do that afterwards? Because I don't have a copy of it. I don't know the answer to that. I don't believe that we have. We have not signed the indictment. Okay. Probably be a good idea to do that. Does anyone have a copy? Because you don't? Okay. Where's the one we were using yesterday? We'll do that in just a minute. You can go ahead with the colloquy. And, Your Honor, we don't have the, the waiver form as well. I believe that the court had one. Right here. I've got blanks. Y'all, y'all filled one out, right? We have. Okay. Thank you. Black excellence, man. Stop playing. Mr. Williams, are you the same Jeffrey Williams indicted in case number two two SC one eight three five seven two? Yes. Okay. And are you? Also known as Young Thug. Yes. Are you at this time taking or under the influence of any alcohol, drugs, or medication? No. Is there any medication that you normally take that you have not been given today? No. How old are you? 33. And how far have you gone in school? Nine. Say that one more time. Nine. Okay. Are you able to read, write, and understand the English... Ninth grade, bro. I still got faith in me. I do got faith in me, bro. You got to have faith in yourself, bro. School ain't, school is not the end of it, bro. <laughs> but hey, for real, though. Language? Yes. All right. Mm -hmm. Are you able to read, write, and understand the English language? Yes. All right. Do you understand that you are charged with the following offenses? Conspiracy to violate... The racketeer influenced and corrupt or I want to buy your house. Yeah, I damn, I don't have a house. house. Yeah. No matter what condition it's in. Organizations Act. Ads, participation in criminal street gang activity. The leadership charge. Participation in criminal street gang activity. Violation of the Georgia Controlled Substances Act. Three counts. Possession of a firearm man. during the commission of a felony. And possession of a machine gun. Do you understand that? Yes. All right. She got this crazy. And do you understand that you have the right to plead either guilty or not guilty to these charges, and that if you plead not guilty or remain silent, you will continue to receive a jury trial? Yes. All right. And have you received this waiver of rights form that I hold in my hand from your attorney? and reviewed it with your attorney? Yes. All right. And is this your signature on the bottom of this form? Yes. Have you had enough time to speak with your attorneys, Mr. Steele and Mr. Adams, about all of the facts and circumstances known to you regarding the charges in indictment 22SC183572, including any potential defenses. Yes. I do really got to look up how much them dudes got paid for. Dog. I want to know them two, the bow, the bow head and the white hair, bro. I want to know how much they got paid for. But I ain't even lying, but I'm not even going to hold it. I'm trying to find out how much money they made, bro. Do you need additional time to discuss this case with your attorneys? No. Are you satisfied with their services? Yes. Mr. Steele and Mr. Adams, do you on behalf of Mr. Williams waive a formal reading of this indictment? Yes, Your Honor. You do. 
And do you, Mr. Williams, waive any and all defects in this indictment, including any with respect to your name? Yes. Have you been arrested on these charges? Yes. The state is unaware of any outstanding warrants related to these charges. Do you or your attorneys know of any outstanding warrants related to these charges? Any what? Outstanding warrants related to any of the charges in the indictment. No. No. I don't believe so either, Your Honor. Okay. And I'm unaware of any as well, Your Honor. I am as well. Thank you. <laughs> Has your attorney, have your attorneys advised you of the minimum and maximum sentence for each of the crimes that you are charged with? Yes. And each of the charges that you are pleading guilty to? Yes. Your Honor, with respect to the charges um, that Mr. Williams faces, count one carries a minimum charge of five years and a maximum charge of 20 years in prison or up to a $25,000 fine or both. Um, isn't it a $15,000 fine because wasn't it the version of the statute in effect at the time or was that the same for Rico? Was Rico 25? Yes, Rico okay. was 25. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Count 56 carries a minimum sentence of five years in prison, a maximum of 20 years in prison, consecutive to any other sentence, with a fine of $10,000 to $15,000, or both. Okay. Count 57 carries a minimum sentence of five years in prison and a minimum maximum sentence of 20 years in prison. Count 58 carries a minimum sentence of one and a maximum sentence of 10 years in prison. Count 59 carries a sentence range of five to 30 years in prison. Count 60 carries a sentence range. slow down just a second. <laughs> Hold on, buddy, the judge say damn? Hold on. Count 60 carries a sentence range. slow down just a second. This is damn, slow down for a second. I'm trying to write down. All right, and that's for the amount of that drug that was found on 59, five to 30? That's as a result of the charge itself, the, I believe, with intent to distribute. I think the 59, Your Honor, uh -huh. is simple possession of cocaine. I have to look at the indictment to be sure. I think sure. that's 60. <laughs> okay. okay. Let me look. Cocaine, right? I can say the yuck. 59 is codeine. Yes. And 60 is cocaine. Yes. So. Hey, that, that, that lawyer on point. Your Honor, it is with the intent to distribute. So my reading of the statute is that it carries the range of 5 to 30. Okay. And Your Honor, also, as I have the indictment in my hand for Ms. Roster, may I pass it to counsel for Mr. Williams? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Your Honor, with the court's permission, I'll permit time for them to. Okay. Count 60 carries a range of one to five years. Are you aware of that? Our sentence? I'm trying to hear the sentence, bro. If, since your plea, your guilty plea is a blind plea or a non-negotiated plea, the state is making a recommendation of sentencing to the court notwithstanding the fact that this is a blind plea. You understand that, Mr. Williams? Yes. Okay. And Mr. Williams, were you aware of the state's previous offer that was turned down prior to your making this non-negotiated plea? Yes. All right. And Your Honor, at this time, the state is making a recommendation of 45 years with 25 to serve in custody, followed by 20 hey, on probation. Ow, what the hell? 
Man, she just throw numbers out there like, God damn. A recommendation. Of, this a recommendation, nigga? Of 45 years. What? With 25 to serve in custody. 25 to serve in custody, followed by 20 on probation. Oh my gosh, what is 20 on probation, man. You got me tripping. I know. We out, man. Hell nah. Ain't nobody do what you make up. What? Hey, behave, y'all. <laughs> Shit. God damn. But, hey, man. Let's keep it pushing. Free Thug Thug is already out, man. We done beat the case, bro. I don't even care if he's 15 years or this and this and that, bro. We done beat the case. Thug is out, bro.